Qatar has pledged $100 million for humanitarian assistance to conflict within Ukraine. It's a big moment for HMC as the corporation announces a major surgical breakthrough that could be adopted worldwide. Qatar Red Crescent Society opens up a pharmacy unit in Sudan where violence has continued. And finally, a battle between two giant footballing neighbors kicks off in Saudi Arabia. Hi, it's Ali. This is The Roundup. Here are today's top stories. Qatar has pledged $100 million in humanitarian assistance to war-struck Ukraine. The aid was handed over to President Volodymyr Zelensky during an official visit to Kiev by Qatar's Prime Minister and Minister of Foreign Affairs, Sheikh Mohammed bin Abdurrahman Al Thani, on Friday. A Ukrainian official confirmed the donated funds will be channeled for reconstruction efforts in the health and education sectors. Qatar is also offering 50 scholarships to Ukrainian students to study at leading Qatar universities. Meanwhile, Doha has also repeatedly called on Russia to respect Ukraine's so sovereignty and territorial integrity as the two continue to engage in a deadly conflict. Now, Hamed Medical Corporation has achieved a major breakthrough in reconstructive microsurgery and hand surgery with more than 100 successful procedures to date. Dubbed the Qatar Flap, the newly produced technology uses a new surgical technique which allows medics to restore the functions of fingertips post-injuries. Now, a doctor from HMC said the breakthrough procedure could be rolled out on a worldwide level. For the entire report, head over to our website. In Sudan, Qatar Red Crescent Society has opened a brand new pharmacy unit in the Jazeera state. The new pharmacy will supply medication for free to 348 displaced families at 49 shelters in Wad Medani. The conflict in Sudan has killed hundreds so far, though activists and volunteer groups say the official death toll could be just the tip of the iceberg. And finally, the King Salman Club Cup is only in its second round of matches, but a blockbuster clash is already on the cards. Heated GCC rivals Al Said and Al Hilal are taking center stage at Prince Sultan bin Abdelaziz Stadium, with both teams looking for three points after opening day draws for the pair. Thank you for joining us. For more of our stories, head over to our website www.dohanews.co. Have a great day.